My name is Hello and uh, welcome back. This is going to be uh, your reading for April 2024. And uh, before anything else, I would like to wish to you happy birthday. Have the happiest birthday that you can have. Uh, April is going to be an amazing month, you will see. And you will see later, I will tell you everything about this month. And um, yes, be the happiest that you can be. You know that I love you so much. You know that I have so many uh, Aries friends. I also have very significant Aries placement in my personal chart. So um, let's uh, let's celebrate because it's a month of celebration. And anyway, uh, to start, I want to say to you once again, thank you so much for all the um, uh, the response to my call for uh, personal readings with the donation. Okay, by donation, of course, I will keep it have it i will keep having this uh, this way okay so anyone that it is um, interesting in a personal reading with me all you have to do is uh, to send me an email you will find my email address uh, in the description box underneath the video okay and you will take it from there uh, as many as you want okay as many as you want for all uh, march and we will see about later what will happen if you want a personal reading with me, okay, with donation, by donation, um, so that I can help as many people as I can. Also, good luck, God bless to the persons that um, have done the change of, uh, of luck, the complete change of luck. You know who you are. Uh, I'll be having um, a little bit later in March, I think that I will be able to offer, unless someone has a really, really urgent need, okay, uh, to change luck. Of course, don't forget about the protection. Pardon my my big, um, my, my long, not big, my long uh, introduction, but I understand that many people send me messages. Uh, so I understand that many people want protection because I receive many messages. So in case you want to be protected, Okay, um, I follow the guidance from monks about the uh, change of luck that I use lots of instances, holy instances and uh, oils and prayers and uh, no matter your religion, okay, things that I have learned from monks that they do it and it's just having amazing results. Anyway, um, let's uh, go uh, whatever you want okay whatever your problem is send me an email and uh, we'll find it so now about um, your month april i will start now with the main astrological uh, aspects hmm, upon the sky what will happen and how will affect you and everyone of course then I will have the astrological prediction for you and then I will have the tarot reading. Okay, I will have the timestamp below. So if you don't uh, want to listen, you can go directly to the tarot reading. And at the end of the tarot reading, as always, I will see what is going on behind closed doors. Okay, and I will give you an advice if I can. So let's start. First of all, you're from the most lucky, so I, I would suggest you to stay and uh, and listen the whole video. You okay, can watch the whole video. Because at the 5th of April, you have Venus in Aries. <laughs> and uh, what it means, okay? We're talking about burning passion. This is an aspect of burning passion. Uh, you will feel more demanding. Um, the Venus in Aries is more demanding as always, okay? So you will feel more demanding to live your life to the fullest, to feel love to the maximum. Of course, we're talking about a very spontaneous okay, uh, aspect. And um, don't forget that lots of opportunities about sudden love will happen to you. The same goes one day later at the 6th because Venus is doing a sextile with Pluto. Okay, this is... Um, this is party time. This is a party time. Sudden relationships, of course, money, of course, love. And uh, absolutely, we're talking about you, Aries, and the persons that uh, have ascendant uh, rising, okay, in Leo, in Libra, in Sagittarius, and 
Aquarius. You benefited, you are definitely okay about all this. And also, um, Leos, Libra, Sagittarius and Aquarius or persons that they have significant planets there or their ascendant. And uh, let's go on because on the, on the 8th, because you have a solar eclipse on your zodiac sign. Okay, this is a very important uh, solar eclipse, not about you, not about me, not about everyone, about all of us, okay, including the world. So uh, many things could be triggered that day. Um, probably I will have a uh, reading about this. And also about all the aspects that you listen from now and on, uh, I can have a reading. I hope that I will have the time to have reading on uh, TikTok. So if you want to follow me there, okay. Uh, you can find the reading about each aspect that we see. At the 8th, we have a conjunction of Sun and Chiron. This is, um, you know, this needs a little bit of, uh, of work because um, scars from the past, uh, wounds from the past may return. So it is a good period to have some kind of like healing or therapy. Absolutely. At the 8th, we also have a conjunction uh, between Mars and Saturn. Mm. Okay. This is very important for the persons that I will say to you. Uh, Gemini's from okay, you're not, but anyway, you if you know your the degrees in your chart, you can calculate that were born from the third until the seventh of June. Uh, the Virgos that were born from the fifth until the ninth, the Sagittarius that were born from the fifth until the ninth of December, uh, September, okay, fifth the ninth of uh, September for Virgos, and uh, fourth to seventh for Pisces that were born in March. Very significant, very powerful, very powerful uh, conjunction, this one. And a little bit, okay, okay, maybe, maybe a little bit difficult too. But now comes the fun. <laughs> From now on comes the fun. And listen, okay, listen. At the 17th, we have Venus with North Node conjunction. Of course, you, Aries. Cancers, Libras, and uh, Capricorns. New love, new relationships, fun, flirt, everywhere, everywhere. And at the 19th, we have a Mercury with the Venus conjunction. <laughs> for you, it's party. And uh, okay, for you, for Libras and the Sagittarius. If Aries, you want a reconciliation, you want a person from the past, or you want some ex-partner, ex-friend that you haven't seen, for a long time, okay? Easily, easily is the best time to have some kind of reconciliation. Also, we have a Jupiter conjunction Uranus. Okay, this is, uh, wow. For you, Virgos, Pisces, Scorpios, Taurus, and with Ascendant, okay? The, with, uh, with the Ascendant, especially for everyone it is, okay? But especially uh, for you, Aries, and um, the before the aforementioned uh, zodiac signs we're talking about sudden luck sudden luck growth chances that this period will extend for whole month uh, actually if i had to to have um, a title here i would say that the impossible becomes possible everything that you want with such kind of aspect you can do it definitely you can do it okay at the 21st we have again venus uh, conjunction with chiron what to say this is super romantic okay love comes into your arms for you aries of course also for persons that uh, have uh, leo capricorn sagittarius and cancer this is super romantic, really, really super romantic um, uh, aspect, really. Love comes into your arms. And uh, three, okay, I, I will say to you also, also, okay, it is not just romance, okay? It is also about uh, sex. And if you want a really romantic relationship, flirt, a sexual relationship that will shake you, you know, you are from the most likely. You, Aries, Libras, and uh, Sagittarius 
will have this um, imagine that some of you are an Aries with Libra ascendant or Sagittarius ascendant okay it will be okay whatever just burning I don't know <laughs> just fire you know anyway okay let's go to the 24th that uh, we have full moon in Scorpio mm. okay power games we are talking about power games and uh, the 29th we have uh, Venus in Taurus okay you have lots of benefits about your uh, romantic and love life now it's time for you to have also lots of benefit at your second house at your money at your uh, possessions your financial possessions okay so you absolutely you Taurus Leos uh, Aquarius and Scorpius and Virgos and Capricorns okay love and money absolutely for you mostly about money and if you want even more about you I'm saying to you it's your month okay from the 30th you have Mars into your sign and this is an aspect of success Aries is an aspect of success of success for you absolutely also for Capricorns and Cancers and Libras I would say is an amazing uh, amazing month and I will also tell you a few more things about this and then we'll go to the tarot okay so in general this is a month of renewal of restart of finally you being able to control your own life as we said people will return not only that day about reconciliation okay but in general in April people will return to you and contact you uh, maybe friends that you haven't heard uh, uh, for so long uh, maybe family members would like uh, to visit you maybe colleagues mm, absolutely you will be tempted also I see that uh, somehow you'd like to hide and uh, work for things unseen okay maybe that could be a trap for some of you but you know better what to do the point is that you will be having throughout the month tremendous power I know that you have some stress I know that you will be having some fears but do you know what it is not because things are difficult it is actually because you don't have the things that you want when you want them it will come for example you want something to happen tomorrow or this week okay and delays because it will delay we will going to have some delays in April and this can stress you but it will come we are not talking about any kind of cancellation okay uh, just some delays so this is totally in my opinion totally workable and be sure that uh, from mid of May until the end of May to see a chance that will appear to you and uh, that specific chance may need uh, from your side to have um, enough resources you know it may need that you are going that you will be needing to have enough resources so to make it happen and don't miss that kind of opportunity you may also um, have uh, chances from sudden profit we have said this okay absolutely absolutely what else what do you want you want a career you can have you want uh, about uh, love you can have on all these or finances on all this there should be if you want um, the need to consult a specialist now is it a lawyer is it an accountant is it um, uh, I don't know a tarot reader is it an astrologer is it um, someone that has specific knowledge if you do so if you do so you will find out about a chance that uh, it can help you so much it's going to be an amazing really 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 amazing chance and it will have amazing results okay but we will need to have a specialist of course of course as we said there will be delays okay there will be the reconciliation that uh, we have said before but what I want you to know is that this month is the most significant for chances for opportunities about love and money the whole month okay and now if uh, I don't know 
you can have a spare something spare like uh, electronic devices or something okay like a um, spare phone or uh, backup battery at your laptop let's say and um, small things like this and that okay you know it's mercury well, what can we do uh, mercury brings such kind of uh, situations that can be a little bit annoying in any case we're talking about an amazing month and uh, for sure i am certain that you are going to have tremendous chances and a wonderful wonderful time uh, around your birthday okay so let me see with the cards now it was interesting right to have to analyze every month uh, all the the major aspects and how it will be for you and for everyone and let's see with the cards Let's see with the cards. Of course, um, past, future, okay, a uh, major event. Where you are right now, what is coming to you, and you don't know your hopes and outcome. Hmm? And at the end of this, what is hidden behind your back, Aries? That's your card. This is your card, and this is what passion and lust and sex. <laughs> this is your Amy card. This is the Amy card. Okay, let's see. determination beautiful for a new beginning and you're having you had been waiting this long time okay you had been waiting about this and now as i told you you are going to be powerful we are talking about the restart of your life and here is the restart of your life trust me you can do it mm -hmm. not bad at all oh Your home, your house, your home will support you a lot, friends and uh, and family, or even something regarding your uh, your house. Okay, son, I love it. News? <laughs> what news? This is not just news, you know. <laughs> Do you really want to know? Okay. Now you will say, but I don't care about sex. I don't care about sex. Okay, maybe it can be ideas about new jobs and opportunities and projects. Okay, but here it comes. No, you're irresistible. You will be just irresistible. Passion and lust as much as you want. Already from the fifth, as I told you, Venus comes into your zodiac sign. What more do you expect? Passion and lust and love and flirt and... Uh, oh. Aries, Aries. Oops. Let me see. Ah, the stress, the stress, and uh, the fears that you. Yes, yes, the fears, absolutely. And you know they don't allow you to evolve. The fears and the stress that you have about the difficulties that I told you. The difficulties. Of course, I can understand that they can be real difficulties. Okay, but think. Hmm? that maybe uh, all this is coming to you as I told you because uh, you don't have the things that you want when you want hmm? it doesn't mean that they will not come they will come and let me see what also will come to you and you don't know what is coming to you you don't know Who could ever stop you? No one. You have the Ace of Swords and you have the Sun. Yes, the past two will come. The King of Wands maybe will come to you from the past or at least wants to return. Okay? Wants to return. A King of Wands from the past. If you want. 
If you want, you can accept. I don't think that I'm going to have a second part hmm, of reading, so I don't think that I can read about that person. But uh, wants to return into your life. Here we're talking about a very, very possible reconciliation, or at least you're going to have news hmm? that wants to return into your life. Who is going to make you happy? This person from the past will make you happy? Passion and flirt and love and sex? Or a new project is going to make you happy is going to bring you the star the ace of swords the ace of wands the sun and the star all yours coming to you and you have no idea about this no idea about this okay let's move on victory and success luck sudden luck you can have about to change your whole life let me see more your hopes are you hoping for a king of pentacles or that person is hoping for you and our money and again the ace of swords what you are hoping for is coming to you and you don't know and this has to do with money this has to do with a proposal with has to, this has to do with a chance and comes to you is not only the one only this one you are hoping about let's say not minor but compared to this one yes is minor this is major you are hoping about uh, this and comes to you double chance bigger chance an opportunity this the exact that you want is coming to you and one more as i told you uh, it will not surprise me at all if we see for example a hair fund at some point you know that uh, is the specialist that will make it happen actually but unstoppable regarding also friendship or partnership something good can come from there could be just support you know they will support you and show you the way okay and an outcome Let's have an outcome. Success. And that's my ears. I'm just so happy for you. You have the Ace of Cups and the World. I told you it's going to be an amazing month. Amazing month, amazing month. Okay, I will keep it here so that you can, you and me, are going to enjoy this beautiful Ace of Cups that uh, will bless you this month because I feel that you will be blessed. Okay, now let's start the clarification and uh, we will see. Start from the past, okay? And see why this past is connected. Ah, it's also the past here. Strength and victory, and uh, I love it. Mm, I love it, but. It feels that you trusted something or someone, you invested in something or someone that, uh, or you had hopes, you know, maybe this is part of your difficulties here and your fears, okay? I will see at the end of the reading. So I'm saying to you that uh, it could be that you wanted to have a new, ah, that this is why. Can you understand now? This is why. Okay. I will explain to you. You wanted to be very strong, 
and take control of your life as I told you in the very very beginning okay now uh, okay you want it but not only take control of your own life hmm? to also have your card the nine of cups to be able Aries to do what you want to achieve the goals your goals to make your dreams to come true and uh, you want it this of course you want it this fast and you wanted to have this new beginning okay but but in the past was an illusion all this wish fulfillment and the strength and the power and the determination and the new beginning was an illusion and now you'll say to me why you, that makes you happy it, this is not making me happy but the ace of swords is making me happy the fast progress is making me happy the ace of swords that is coming to you and you don't know that you want it and it's coming to you no matter what and the new beginning that you didn't have in the past because all this had been just an illusion it is coming to you now and as i told you it will come fast and as i told you who can stop you no one no one can stop you to have exactly the things that you wanted in the past and you could not have they are coming now to you and they are coming fast 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 really fast really fast that's why it's beautiful let me see your focus now ouch ouch look in your life right now if you look carefully that's why I told you in the, also in the beginning when I told you about the personal reading with the with donation okay by donation is right okay I told you about the change of luck and I told you about protection why because right now there is a person around you that his or her aim because that's your focus here focus okay to be disappointed to be stressed even to be depressed why because it's cheating on you it doesn't mean that we're talking about sexual cheating only okay no no it is not cheating is not only sexual can could be that steals money from you that will steal that says bad things behind your back so that uh, will get a promotion or to destroy your career and stuff like this and i'm saying bad things why because here's the devil someone has you at his or her target hmm? and that person is the devil that's why i told you that better had some some kind of protection from this because of your focus so someone is focused on you and that person is a devil to cheat on you and to make you sad you should not allow that person to do it okay open your eyes there is ah nice this is complicated here we have uh, a person that definitely as i told you family or friends and uh, uh, will save you will support you a lot because because i see a person here the king of wands okay could be the person from the past hmm? that will return of course would like to have sex with you this uh, there is no doubt about this okay but i'm not sure that, that person you can trust that much so in this dynamic about this person that i'm not sure that you can trust that much okay and you being having the nine of pentacles you being um uh, independent definitely not dependent from that person or maybe as you had been in the past i don't know and you choosing your own career your own self prioritizing yourself on this dynamic your family will help you 
or something regarding your home okay so returning back home i mean and um, enjoying a hobby of yours so you know to distress to make your mind calmer to think calmer what you should do okay it's like um, your home will be the place of peace of harmony that uh, no one can touch you there and you need this around this period especially in the dynamic of that person it could be a person from the past i don't know some of you want some of you don't want it depends but could be a completely new person because we have seen so many aspects that you can meet so many new people okay the page of wands was with the ace of wands mm -hmm. and what was that your future is coming to you <laughs> crazy ah. this is awesome finally Aries do you know what will happen you will understand maybe you'll be informed maybe somebody will open your eyes and says to you Aries what are you doing here why are you sabotaging your own happiness why are you sabotaging your own abundance why are you doing this you must be the Queen of Pentacles as you have been here you not must will also happen you will prioritize yourself through an information or a person that will say something to you and will just uh, awake you know stop doing this stop sabotaging yourself or stop the persons that they try to sabotage your abundance and this way because you will find and you will stop it also includes your love life hmm? when you will realize it and understand it you take the decision and you have the power to achieve everything as the queen of pentacles and of course to have your abundance and i understand the pain that i see here i understand the pain that i see here it was not easy at all for you it was not easy at all for you i know but it comes to you it comes to you aries Even if you don't go there, there will come to you. Okay. What is going on here now? Oh, beautiful. So many beautiful things. <laughs> so many beautiful things. Oh, okay, so many beautiful things. Tonight for you and this month for you. I told you about uh, lost chances, about you fighting with yourself about feeling stressed feeling having fears okay it will stop the world will come and give a closure to this energy and will come and open a new chapter in your life we have double confirmation you have the past that was an illusion that you have a new beginning and the things right now about fears about stress about problems hmm? That will stop and a new cycle will open for you and and here comes the same card if you have been problems with uh, home with your apartment with a family member everything will change now because you see support from here and you see lots of balance hmm? and even happiness and love that's it love now will I say the thing that you don't want to hear most of you I don't know maybe you want maybe you want yes again the reconciliation again an awakening if you don't want it if it's not if you don't care about this do you know what and who will open also your heart so to receive the love or show you the way how to attract the love a hervant that of course is a person that can heal you somehow if you need this kind of thing if you don't need that person will be around you if you ask for I told you the specialist remember that will 
attract love into your life that will awaken you so to avoid the devil so to stop sabotaging your own self and have your ace of cups in abundance and so to bring love into your life what is coming to you and you don't know is trying to speak already <laughs> Come on, just come on, come on. You want love? Take love, have love, as much as you want. This is celebration, okay, um, fun, pleasure, absolutely, but we are not talking about any kind of, um, let's say, sick, okay? Pleasure, I mean like uh, three and four and five and 10 and 100 uh, party situations here, okay? No love <laughs> and it could be the love that you are waiting for it could be the love that you are waiting for stable true real sudden sudden okay it could be for some of you even uh, from abroad and for the third time we see at the end that is coming to you and you don't know the ace of swords unstoppable i can guarantee the success to you it's just that you have to you know do your part the cards have it for you the stars have it for you the divine has it for you it's just that you stop should stop open your eyes and stop sabotaging your own self areas and it's going to a new beginning in your life that you have always wanted Let me see your hopes. Ah, it is connected. The King of Swords is somehow connected to uh, what you're hoping for. Hmm, but it's stagnant. It has to do with uh, with work. Ah, maybe that person you have to know that uh, will change job. Hmm? Maybe will lose money. Maybe wants to come to you and offer this to you, but I see that person being uh, stagnant, you know, mm. being stagnant. Let me see something that's interesting. I cannot uh, read for the King of Swords because you know that needs another reading so that I could see the persons that they are coming to you. But uh, let me see the stagnation. This I can see. Why there is stagnation there? Mm. Okay, okay. This has to do, for some of you, a project or uh, your or his or hers. Okay, the kings of the king of swords uh, own business that is planning right now. Mm. or work in a big company in an international company something like this big one is is big okay it's huge huge job there uh, but uh, is it stagnant because the energy is a lot is lots of energy and feels that cannot have control and what is doing right now it is not that it is stagnant the king of swords it is because it's gathering strength right now so obviously to come to you and offer you this uh these pentacles but the pentacles will not only these not only this will come even bigger than this will come to you and let me see the new stage uh the, the new chapter of your life <laughs> of course the new chapter of your life comes with the world stopping the difficulties and the pain here and opens uh, a new chapter for your life with the world okay and here you have the wheel of fortune definitely come on Aries. definitely okay of course i see it what i see the higher fund that i told you that can help you always can help you a person especially this month okay especially this month to show you the way how to move on And what else? 
there is competition there is competition and actually you are going to have competition uh, in this new chapter but the competition actually is not uh, let's say against you <laughs> do you know what is between an emperor and a king of cups that they both try to stop each other so it is like uh, the king of cups tries to block the emperor so to have free path for you to be part of your life the emperor is trying to block the king of cups so that the path will be free and open for the emperor <laughs> that's why they're they, they're going to fight for you actually and the funny thing is that very very strong very strong and again and again here comes the hierophant i don't know what i don't know really what is going on with uh with you and uh how much you need such kind of advices and guidance okay but obviously too many people too many energies uh, wonderful events and chances that's why i understand i understand i understand and let me see now what is um, hidden from you let me see let me see I even look at the cards you know and I see a very very beautiful vibe from this one with new beginning and uh, new beginning one and two are crowned by two ace of cups you know the fool is crowned by the ace of cups the world is crowned by the ace of cups it's just amazing amazing i just want you as i told you to be there don't sabotage yourself okay oh. see okay you feel okay what is uh more psychological and uh, what is hidden behind your back there is some kind of suppression around you of course what are we talking about of course you feel that you have taken a wrong direction in life from the past because it was illusion of course you even feel that uh, the knowledge that you're having okay here is knowledge the knowledge that you are having, you you handle it in a wrong way because it doesn't give you the profit and uh, uh, the benefits that you could have. At the same time, you feel that you are losing strength, that you are tired, that uh, you cannot be at your full potential. I also understand this, of course, of course, of course it is because I told you, you have tried a lot. You have tried a lot, this is not easy, this is difficult. And to be here and watching me right now, it means that you have passed this stage and it was difficult and I know, I know. And the next step after the Ten of Swords is the Ace of Cups. Okay, let's move on because here is the best one, okay? Uh, apart from this, news that delay, I told you, don't be like this. Okay, you can be. Okay, uh, Aries, you're an Aries and I cannot advise you because you will hate me. Okay, I know that you will hate me, so I cannot say to you what you want to do. You can do anything that you want, but I understand that uh, there are news that delay and uh, you feel that they restrict you somehow because, you know, your Aries, you are so dynamic, you want to do the things and when you are restrained and restricted, uh, it's not your best absolutely absolutely for some of you it could be also maybe there was or will be maybe was a trip with um, with problems uh, difficult problems here and there here and there there is a chance that some of you also you feel that uh, you have lack of help and people cannot help you and this was the past because as I told you in the beginning, okay, 
people can return, ex-colleagues, people that you haven't talked, uh, friends that you haven't met uh, for a long time and stuff, that, it, that they wanted to support you, but for their reasons, for any reason, they could not be by your side, they will return back into your life now. And as a result, I will say this to you, because it, it just, I, I love it, okay? If, and you know that I don't read about health, but if some of you had some kind of small problems here and there, they will be solved 100%, totally, totally. I see healing and therapy. I see healing and therapy. Especially remember about the aspect that we had said before, okay? About the 8th, uh, especially of uh, April, with that Sun and the uh, Chiron conjunction that will bring the wounds, hmm? will bring the problems, maybe this will be brought into you to surface because you have to do something about this. And yes, it is about healing, it is about uh, therapy, harmonic relationships, and I wish that you could uh, read Abundance. It is like the water is everywhere and it is abundance. You can have everything in your life, from feelings up to money, relationships, love, harmony, peace, a new beginning. Of course, passion and party and stuff. Okay, you are areas you have to also pay attention to such kind of things. But uh, the most significant areas of your life start already from April. Is a month of power, of renewal and restart for you. Eris, thank you so much for watching this reading. Again, I want to wish you to have um, the best birthdays that you can that you can have that you have ever had in your life. I want to send you from the bottom of my heart all my wishes for luck, for love, for prosperity, for money, uh, for health, for anything your heart desires to have it. I love you so much especially the areas that you know who you are that um, my life crossed your life these three years and of course um, you will be in my heart forever i hope the same for myself too that i will be in your heart forever anyway i uh, don't want to get emotional my hugs my love don't forget if you want a personal reading uh, and please someone say to me on the, on the comments, is it with donation or by donation? So I will say it properly from now on. <laughs> I think that it is by donation. Anyway, uh, okay, you donate and that's it. So to help as many people as I, as I can. If there is any really urgent need about change of luck, okay, with the style of monks that I told you, you can message me, but I think that, uh, okay, whatever. If there is any real urgent, okay, urgency, do and protection, protection, Aries. Protection. Okay, I'm sending you my hugs, my love again. Take care, as always. We'll talk soon about the aspects that we have seen. I hope that I will do on TikTok, okay, uh, during April. So if you have TikTok and uh, you can, you want to follow, you're welcome. Uh, the same with uh, Instagram. Anyway, okay. My, my love to everyone. Take care, happy birthday, and uh, bye for now.